Hello, hello everybody. This is Henry from Fun Game Reviews. We are going to get into some fun little action here. What we're going to be doing today is figure out which hero has the best divine and which one will be the most practically used divine out of all of them, guys. So yes, we're definitely going to be trying this. We're going to be doing several different versions of this so you guys can see it. So it's going to be all kinds of fun. So let's begin. All right, guys. So let's get the music going here. And uh, let's do this. Let's do this. Here we go. Here we go. So what we're going to do is we're going to go farm it up. We're going to go farm it up. All right. So let's do it. Let's do it. Here we go. All right, so all we're going to be doing is using Rene then and any hero, guys. We're going to use Rene then and any hero, guys. So here we go, here we go. What we're going to do is we're just going to take two heroes. We're going to use the divine instantly and then provide that same hero a divine again and see what it really can accomplish. So as you guys can see, we're looking for the most efficient attack, guys. We're looking for the most efficient attack. As we speak right now, it definitely is not the most efficient right here with using Abyss Demon. He can actually do a definite, like, good amount of damage uh, using that twice. And he also does stun the enemy, guys. He does use stuns on the enemy so abyss demon looks okay but when it comes to conquering a base that definitely did not look like one of the good ones so here we go we're gonna use pangoli we're gonna go for pangoli here let's do this he instantly melts everything launches another attack look at that and then instantly attacks again and then launches another attack look at that that assault literally with pangoli is just insane that is why pangoli is considered number one hero killer guys number one hero killer all day every day yeah 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 so you guys could definitely see that yes sir yes sir all right next on my list let's go try out mr great sage yeah let's see if great sage can manage it we definitely gonna see if Grey Sage can manage it. Look at that. He is gonna start off with some silencing. Anything that comes in gets just destroyed. So there we go. Use his skill again. And then here we go. Use the divine. Once he gets a little closer, and then use that divine again. This right here is what we call the additional silencing. Not only do you get si extra silences, look at your rage bar. Rage bar literally instantly hits max 10 just because you got to use the skill two times guys yeah not only does it do damage it is definitely making it awesome guys it is definitely making it awesome let's go try toxic shaman all right here comes toxic shaman and we're gonna use his divine and then we're gonna use a skill then we're gonna use his divine again let's try this out let's see there we go. We definitely hit multiple spots, guys. We definitely hit multiple spots. So, yeah. That looks great. That looks great. All right. Here we go. We definitely trying this out. Looking at damage. If you guys were to have missed any heroes with the first divine you guys used, you would have been able to uh, make sure that other heroes were going to get puppeted. All right. That's what we call Puppeteer. Puppeteer. All right, so here we go. We're going to be changing it out. We're going to change it out. Let's see with Ambrosia. How well does she do with Double Divine? All right, we're definitely going to be testing this out, guys. Let's go test it out. Here we go. Double Divines, guys. Yeah, yeah. So here we go. We're going to come in from this corner. And then we're going to go and use the Divine. Getting ready here. Look at this. All of them start coming closer and closer. We're going to be giving back the divine to Miss Ambrosia. Oh, what happened to the divine? Did I use it too quickly? 
I might have used that too quickly. It didn't even give me a chance to use the divine again. But look at that. Almost just one shot almost cleared the entire base. One shot literally cleared everything. If I had that second uh, wave, it definitely would have killed it all. So let's go. Let's try this again. What I think I didn't do is I, I maybe didn't wait enough. I didn't wait long enough. So let's try that. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, so once we kill this base, we're going to keep moving. We're definitely going to keep moving on here. We're going to try Ambrosia one more time here. We're going to try her again because I must have screwed up somewhere. Uh, because that skill did not go off. Uh, so let's try that again. Here we go. Ambrosia luring in the horde. And then here we go. She gets her skill back and then does it again. Let's see if she can completely clean up this base. Oh, like misses some little tiny pieces of the base. That's ridiculous. I thought she single-handedly was going to get a 100%. I really thought so. I really thought so. All right. So here we go. 55,000. 55,000 gold. All right. So that's Ambrosia. Let's go see who else is on the list. You know what would be funny? Oh, my God. That would be so funny. Oh, uh, but I know you can't use rainy. Oh my god. Can you? Can you? Oh, no, 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 no. I messed up there. Uh-oh. What was there prior? I don't remember. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah. I think it was Ambrosia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Ambrosia. Uh, so let's see. Let's see. Go back here. Instead of Ambrosia, what we're going to do is now we're going to change it to Wonton. Let's go try out Wonton. Ooh, but Wonton, we got to definitely use a different weapon here. So let's do that. Here we go. Here we go. Nice. So now we're going to go try out Wonton, guys. We're going to go try out Wonton. Let's see how well Wonton does it. Here we go. Explosion of the base. Explosion of all the heroes. Look at that. They all are literally just annihilated. All right, so here we go. We're going to use that skill. We're going to push the heroes back, destroy them. And here comes the next bolt of damage. Oh, the hero took it and absorbed the damage. Ridiculous. I was expecting a massive explosion once again, and it just didn't happen. Look at that explosion with Wonton. That has such a range. Re freaking ridiculous. No joke. No joke. All right, here we go, here we go. So next, what we're going to do is we're going to try the next hero. The next hero is Arcane Caster. I know, I know, I know. If we were to be using Landslide, Landslide, it's just, it's just two punts. Two punts really doesn't do too much, but we're going to try him anyway. We definitely will try him anyway. He's not that efficient when it comes to that. So here we go. I like this base look at this we're gonna we're gonna have to control the heroes once the heroes come then we use the skill then we use the skill so look at that boom look at that massive damage yeah oh it's not even that much damage look at that. it barely even taking any damage so ridiculous all right we're gonna try that again and then let's activate the skill oh but nothing is attacking nothing is attacking so sad so sad all right so obviously her skill isn't the greatest i mean she does make it so that it's it makes it harder for the enemy to to cast uh like strong attacks on her i mean if you guys know with her enlightenment she does make it so that she weakens the enemy she weakens the enemy all right so let's try again we're gonna go use another hero uh, let's go try out a landslide. We're gonna we'll give him a, a beefcake weapon. Let's see. Let's see how big of an explosion he can make. Let's let's actually see how big of an explosion he makes, guys. So here we go. Here we go. All right, we're gonna put her on the outside. Let's make sure we do that. And then punt it. Look at that. And then here we go and punt him again, just like that. Damn. That explosive power did just like literally half this base just wiped out because of landslide. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see, guys. All right, landslide did tremendously well as well. Look at that. I mean, 
given that his account is ridiculously strong. Ridiculously strong. You know what I mean? So let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going and do a full on a review of all heroes using two divines. All right, let's try this out. Let's go see Berserker next. Yeah, yeah. Can Berserker do some massive damage? I think so. All right, so here we go. We're going to make it so that he got minions four days. Minions four days. Here we go. We launched the first set of minions. Then we launched the next set of minions. That's what's up. Look at that army. Look at that army. Oh, yeah. Oh, it doesn't even... It didn't make more. No way. That sucks. It didn't make more. I was really thinking it was going to make, like, quadruple the set of, like, little mercenaries. Damn. I really thought that would have been, like, nice. That means that you can have some massive mercenaries. I really thought that would have been pretty cool. I would have thought that would have been pretty darn cool. If that was, if that was doable, that would have been freaking awesome. That would have been awesome. But that, that didn't happen. You guys saw it. That didn't happen. So let's go try again. Let's go with... Uh, we'll go with Chiron. Chiron, we, we know his potential. We definitely know his potential. So let's go see this right here. I wonder... I wonder if two of them will be created. I wonder if two of his, uh, his things will be created or not. Alright, so here we go. We're trying this out. We're definitely trying this out. Here we go. All right. Here we go. First one. And then let's go boost it up. Boom. All right. Here we go. We're going to give that skill one more time. And then here we go. Let's see. Let's see. And boom. Here's, here's it. Does he make two? Does he make two? What I'm looking for is does he make two of those big clones? As of right now, I only see one. I don't actually see two. Uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh. I do I see two? No, I only see one. No, I only see one. Oh wait, no, no, I see two. Look at that, I see two. Look at that, I see two. <laughs> that is ridiculous. That's what's up, man. Look at that. Now I have three humongous Chirons. Oh my God, that is that. That is cool. That is cool right there. If you guys don't. Think about it, yeah, that is cool. All right, you guys saw, you get your massive army of Chirons in the party. That's what I like to see, that's what I like to see. All right, so let's go try this again. We are definitely trying out all the heroes. Let's see, let's see. All right, uh, Enchantress is completely useless. She just makes it so that the immunity happens. That's not really gonna do too much. Two immunities, uh, well, that's not really going to change too much. So let's go try Arctic Lord. Arctic Lord probably ain't going to do too crazy. I mean, he's going to he's gonna, he's gonna definitely nuke somebody. He's definitely going to nuke somebody, I think. So let's try it. All right, here we go. Here we go. And then let's do this nuke. The first nuke shot has gone out. The second nuke shot goes out. Look at that. Hell yeah. And then here comes... The Arctic Lord Spinner. There we go. There we go. Nice. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. I'll admit it. I thought that was pretty awesome. All right. So he got to shoot two of them out. Kind of like uh, Pangoli. But he only shot. He shot out twice. So that was cool. That was cool. All right. So let's do it. Let's do it. Fly across the screen here. There we go. There we go. All right, so there we go. That is completely done. Let's go try the next hero. Oh yeah, we're just trying to see all the different scenarios, different different things that will happen. You know what I mean? It's gonna, it's kind of cool. Let's let's see with Carol D Bell. Can she get two snowmans? I think two snowmans gonna be pretty tight. Two snowmans will be pretty cool. Let's try that out. Let's try that out. Boom. Let's get that first snowman. Yeah. All right, here we go. Let's get that second snowman. Whoa, bam. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I like to see. Look at that. Do 
major golems running around. Oh yeah. You bring in your own army, Carol D. Bell. That's what's up. Hell yeah. And that's what I like to see, guys. Right there, look at that. Two of them tanking it up, tanking it up. Yeah, yeah. All right. So here we go. That is a full clear right there. Let's go try some more. Let's go try some more, guys. Yeah, yeah. All right. So we're definitely checking it out, guys. Testing out all the different scenarios possible when you can get two divines each and every time. All right. So we definitely going to skip Enchantress. We already know her skill doesn't do that. Uh... Demon Slayer, you're going to just pull in all the heroes. Uh, I'm thinking you're going to pull in the, the furthest two, and then you're going to pull in whatever two is not pulled in yet. So that one's really not that, not really going to help. I know Skull Mage is going to be awesome. Skull Mage definitely going to be wicked power. Let's see it. Let's see it. This is what we call the Wizard Team. This is what everybody does for the Wizard Team, because you want to have that invincibility mode for as long as you can all right invincibility mode for as long as you possibly can so here we go we're gonna do it right here we're gonna do it right here look at this first first one has gone out first one has gone out all right we're gonna make it so that we're ready for the second one we definitely ready for the second one so let's try it let's try it here we go here we go all right look at that and uh, the next one boom Look at that, before they can even think about it, they are still invincible. You're just watching how long they stay invincible. That is just ridiculous. Look at that, the little mercenaries just melting everybody down. Hell yeah, that's what I like to see, guys. Look at that, and it's already all done. Already all done. That's what I like to see, guys. That's what I like to see. That is how you keep all your wizards alive. For as long as possible. This is when you guys get your wizard team lineups, guys. All right. Ooh, let's go see. Let's go see. Safrix. Safrix. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Make that explosive bomb. Here we go. Here we go. All right, Safrix. All right, first one goes out. Let's zoom out real quick. Oh my god, I let the horde go. All right, it's okay. It's okay. What we're trying to see is can the entire base be destroyed? Oh, he apparently does not destroy the entire base. That that was not as great as I, I assumed. I really thought that would have done better, but that didn't do that well. I mean, he is Pisces, guys. He is Pisces. Uh, and, I mean, obviously, this is not a strong base either. This is really not a strong base either. So Safrix didn't do that well. Uh, like my zoom out actually made it so all my heroes came out. But it's okay. It's okay. Uh, Woven Fiend. Yeah, Woven Fiends, whatever. Uh, Woven Fiend will just heal himself. I mean, that's... It, it's not going to be that great. Woven Fiend will, is more of like a single target one. It's definitely not going to be that great. So let's try d -Ginny. I mean, d -Ginny is also one of those single targeters. So let's try it. Here we go. Let's teleport. Boom. Teleportation, baby. And then let's do it. Let's do it. Here we go. We are making them all go nuts. Confusing. Confusion. Oh, yeah. There we go. We kept them all kind of jacked up. Oh, yeah. There we go. Look at that. Pop to the enemy and just goes and wipes him out. That's what I like to see, guys. D. Jenny. Like a beast. D Jenny is pretty good, guys. Pretty good. All right, so D Jenny gets it. All righty. He just kind of confuses them uh, with his divine a little bit. Uh, it doesn't look too crazy. It doesn't look too amazing. Uh, uh, I can't use wrath. So okay, Demon Slayer. Bullhead. Ooh, Ironclad. Ooh, hold on. I, I forgot about Ironclad. Uh. Yeah, I forgot about Ironclad, so let's let's go see. All right, let's go try out Ironclad. And we'll take him out. We'll put Ironclad in. 
Let's do that. Let's do that. And then we'll give him this weapon. Um, and then let's just put in the weaker iron cloud for now. Let's do that. And then, yeah. Let's go try it out. Iron class style, baby. Iron class style. Ooh, this one's like perfect for it. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, here we go. Launching the attack. First attack has assaulted. There we go. There we go. All right. So let's do it. Let's do it. Nice. Oh my gosh. And it lasts for so long. Here we go. Let's get the next onslaught going. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Look at that onslaught. Yeah. All righty. Oh, you can't even cancel it. That's so sad. You can't cancel it. All right. There we go. Explosive. Explosive. And then look at that. All I can say is he definitely can nuke like the, the stronghold. Worst case scenario, he will nuke that freaking thing to the ground. That's so wickedly awesome. All right, so let's see. What other heroes did we miss? Did we miss? We could try Bull, uh, Bullhead. Bullhead's okay. Bullhead's okay, but he's not, he not that good. Uh, he's going to launch out two weapons. Uh, you know what? I, I don't give Bullhead enough credit. I don't give Bullhead enough credit. So let's go try it out. Let's go try it out. Let's see how well he does. Yeah, I, I don't give Bullhead enough credit. I mean, Bullhead definitely needs a little bit more credit than that. He definitely does. So here we go. We're going to try out Bullhead. Let's go see what his skill looks like. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go, Bullhead. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Here we go. Launch that skill, baby. Launch that skill. Yeah. And then here we go. We're going to launch another one. And in we go. Boom. Shaka laka. Look at that. Yeah. And then look at that. He has a, his own little spinning weapon. Look at that. He just plows through everything. Just plowing through the base. Look at that. Just walks through all the walls. I love him, dude. Look at that. Just walking through walls, man. I love it. Look at that. Look at that. You need your path cleared. Here comes Bullhead. That's what I like to see, guys. That is what I like to see. All right. Bullhead is done here. Let's go check out what other heroes I might have missed. I mean, Dark Rider. Dark Rider is almost there. Oh, Dark Rider actually has it. Uh, but he has, like, no skill. That's... That's a little sad. That's a, that's a little sad. He does not have anything. Um, and then for those of you guys who know about Hy uh, Hydrosaur, we can see Hydrosaur makes it so that people just completely useless. Uh, yeah, we could definitely try out Hydrosaur. Uh, but Hydrosaur really ain't going to do too much. He's not going to do too much. But he's still good. He's still good. He, he is very much uh, important for all of you guys who use uh, flying teams. Flying teams pretty much need them. He's like a necessity. All right, so watch this. Basically, everything is going to be deemed useless. Everything's going to be deemed useless. Oh, I thought he had a divine. I lied. I lied. This one does not have anything. Hold on. Let's go cancel it so we're not wasting time here. Uh, let's go. Wait, hold on. What happened to the other? What happened to the Hydra Sword that had something? Hold on. It, does he even have one? Oh, I actually... Actually, I lied. He does not have one. Oh, my God. I thought he did. I thought he personally did. All right, here we go. We're going to try out... Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Yeah, we're going to try out this one. He has at least up to Virgil, at least level 1 Divine, guys. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Using Storm Rider. Let's go check out Storm Rider. Let's see. Let's see. Here we go. We're going to come in from the bottom. All right. We're definitely going to try to use his skill. Let's see how that looks like. Let's see how it looks like. Oh my god, I'm failing. 
Actually, where's the heroes? Like, I was assuming that was gonna do something. Uh, I mean, look at the divine. I mean, it doesn't. It looks like the flying heroes kind of go a little faster, but it, do, it doesn't look that crazy. It doesn't look that crazy. Oh, dude, it would be. Oh, dude, this would be pretty sick right now. Like, I'm just thinking about all of the heroes that can do ma like multiple damage, like all at the same time. I'm, I'm just thinking about that right now. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool stuff. Eh, he didn't look that amazing. He, he didn't look at the. He didn't really look that appealing. Let's try that again. Let's try that one more time. Uh, he. I, I mean, I let everything down. So let's see. Let's see. I was actually hoping for more. I was hoping for more. So let's do it. Start off the first attack, and then start out the next shot here. Let's see. Let's see. Look at that. He brings in. Oh, dude! I just realized he brings in. The Divine actually brings another hero. That is actually cool. I, I, w I mistakenly didn't notice that. Look at that. He brought in a Wolven Fiend. Level 160 Wolven Fiend. Ridiculous. Alright. Still good. Still good. Oh, look. He brought in another one. Nice. He brought in Ambrosia and he brought in a Woven Fiend. But look at that. Woven Fiend disappeared though. Did Woven Fiend disappear? Yeah. Sadly, you did. He, he, like, he disappeared. I was hoping there was going to be a second one. But no, there isn't. There isn't. No problem. No problem. But other than that, guys, that's pretty much all of the different heroes. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is... The test of who has the best double divine. What you guys think? Make sure you put comments down below. Let me know what you guys think, all right? Hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you guys for watching. This is Henry from Fun Game Reviews. I'm out. Peace out.